Hello? Patch through for Metro Dade. Are you Detective Tubbs? Yes, I am. Who is this? I know that you are the man who arrested Mrs. Proverb. And it goes against my heart to do this, but I have to reveal to you the truth. See, I'm impelled by a spiritual force deep inside of me, and it is bigger and deeper than even what I can control. What are you, smoking? Snorting or drinking? Whatever it is, I don't want any of it. This conversation's over. No, please wait. They are going to try to tell you that she's innocent. But she's not. I know, because I'm in the church. And it's all part of the big lie. The big stuff that they're into now. I can tell you, but I'm afraid. Detective, you're going to have to come here right now. Where are you? Are you the young lady I talked to on the phone? Yes. Well, you got something to say. Let's hear it. I'm late for a date. It's very difficult for me to talk about this. There's a bunch of us girls who work down here as ushers for the Reverend Bill Bob. And, well, all of us are runaways from the street, you see. And the Reverend Bill Bob and Mrs. Proverb, they took us in and helped us all real good. Yeah, so? Well, my name's Faye Nell. Uh -huh. See, I must tell you the truth because I cannot lie. But in order for me to do that, I have to betray my great indebtedness towards very good people. And why, that just about breaks my heart. Help! Help! Oh, God, Ray! Hey. Ray! Help! Oh, Help! 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 Please, don't move! Oh, the great internal affairs investigator Stro. Uh, was it exceptionally slow over there today or what? Very funny. We got our blood on his shirt. A diversionary prowler report to the watchman, and as far as I can ascertain, no reasonable motivation to set Tubbs up. No. How about the uh, Leona Proverb case? Huh? You ever hear that? Angel of the airwaves? No, I guess that wouldn't have anything to do with it. I want to see my partner. Thank you. I got five minutes in the John Crockett. That's all the time you get. Sanchez, give him the room. So what happened? Did you lose your phone book? They sure jumped on this wagon fast. Oh, hell, Rico, they got nothing. They're fishing. Yeah, they got a bruised teenager pointing a finger at a black off-duty cop. Says I wanted to know her in the biblical way. No backup, no alibi. This is a weird frame, man. The switchboard can confirm that she placed the call. What the hell do they think? One look and your libido suddenly went critical? If this wasn't you, I'd think it was funny. It is me, and it's not funny. No guys with suitcases full of money. And drugs, I can understand, being set up by a preacher. Uh, I'll tell you what else. Stro doesn't buy the theory that Bill Bob set this up to take the heat off his wife, either. Sorry, guys. Recess is cut short. These were just delivered. We lifted these off the studio security camera videotapes. Hard to tell who's doing what to who. 